Template Monster presents. Hey there. People often ask me, what is a WordPress plugin? Uh, WordPress plugins actually are a, a very big deal in the website building and website management industry. Uh, you can think of them as the bits of functionality that are installed on top of the WordPress functionality and uh, that improve the, the stuff that, yeah, that you can do with your WordPress website. Uh, according to WordPress Foundation itself, plugins are something that are aimed at extending and expanding the default WordPress functionality. Sounds good, doesn't it? So uh, the, the point is that WordPress itself, out of the box, uh, is pretty much helpless uh, without its little minions, the WordPress plugins. Um, in terms of the, the architecture, uh, you can think of the whole WordPress website thing as, uh, as, as this. There is the, uh, the WordPress engine uh, in the center and uh, there are WordPress plugins and WordPress themes installed on top of the engine. And uh, that combined gives you a, uh, a wholesome WordPress installation and WordPress website. Uh, in terms of the value, uh, you could think of uh, of WordPress plugins as the applications on uh, on your iPhone, for example. Um, I mean, what would the iPhone be without the, the the applications, right? You would still be able to make calls, yes, uh, but you wouldn't be able to uh, to post photos on the Instagram. You wouldn't be able to read news. You wouldn't be able to play games. You wouldn't be able to do tons and tons of awesome stuff that, uh, that makes us love our phones so much. Uh, the same goes with the WordPress, because uh, without plugins, uh, you would only be able to post blog content there, and, and that's pretty much all. Uh, you wouldn't be able to, uh, I don't know, display banners, or uh, you wouldn't be able to display galleries and sliders and uh, some, some different uh, other awesome stuff that uh, they make WordPress uh, websites so awesome. Um, there are two types of WordPress plugins based on how they can be installed. Uh, there are actually two segments of the, the plugins market. Uh, there are plugins that are available for the installation from the official WordPress directory, and there are plugins that uh, are supposed to be installed manually. Uh, with the official directory plugins, uh, they are free to install. They are very easy to install, pretty much like uh, like the apps uh, on the the cell phones that are installed from the the app store. Uh, that's how these things, uh, the plugins, are installed from the official WordPress directory. Uh, there is an integrated update system, again similar to uh, to what we have on our phones. Uh, you may uh, update plugins automatically, you may update them manually, but still that's, that's all done from within uh, the WordPress admin panel. With the, the plugins that, that uh, are being installed manually, most of them are outside of the WordPress directory because they're not free. They're commercial plugins, people build them for money, they, they sell them, uh, and uh, you install these plugins manually, so you have to have the uh, the access to the hosting account, or at least the FTP access, so you could upload the, the plugin files to your uh, WordPress directory, your own, I mean, your own web website uh, WordPress directory, uh, and uh, all of the updates that are released for, for this uh, sort of plugins are also supposed to be uh, installed manually. Um, there's a couple of more facts, uh, interesting facts on the WordPress plugins, actually. Uh, in the official WordPress directory, I, I mean in this section, uh, you may find as many as 40,000 WordPress plugins. That's a lot. That's pretty much anything you can think of 
uh, in terms of you, what you want your website to do has already been covered by at least one WordPress plugin or maybe several plugins. Um, there are thousands and thousands of uh, plugins that are available outside of the WordPress directory. And according to that directory, again, uh, the, the WordPress plugins have been installed one billion times, around one billion times. That's a lot uh, on all of the websites that are powered by WordPress engine. So as you can see, WordPress plugins are a, uh, a pretty big deal in the WordPress industry. Uh, they are very valuable uh, for the community and they are uh, something that makes WordPress what it is and uh, what makes it so awesome. Um, I hope this answers your question. Uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Do you want to get an answer to any question regarding web mastering and getting your business online? Visit templatemonster.com slash startup hyphen hub to learn how you can bring your ideas to life.